another way to stay inspired, especially, you know, to, to keep making music as a rapper. I think just, you know, having an exercise to listen to a lot of beats, download about 20, 30 beats, and just, you know, uh, find the first one that inspires you and go for it. And it sort of becomes like an exercise that, you know, you trust your gut and you go with the first thing that inspires you and you follow that lead. Uh, it does definitely help with staying inspired. Uh, I do it a lot with YouTube beats or even old famous beats, you know, just to kind of lead me in one way, okay, I kind of like this direction of a mob deep sound and I want to go that way but with a fresher trap sound or whatever, you know, like with the same piano, with the piano riff and stuff. So, yeah, it, it's, it's just about, you know, at the end of the day, it's also like a like a muscle you have. You know, you're training a muscle to uh, you know to constantly be able to you know get your brain moving so your pen can you know do its work. So if you're constantly you know uh, ready you know to work on any type of beat and you have that that practice knowledge of you know moving through different beats, I do this thing. We've done it at camps and stuff where uh, at song songwriting camps where we line up four or five beats and we take 15 minutes for each beat. We keep a timer or just, you know, until someone quickly finds an idea or we move on to the next beat if no one finds an idea. So it becomes like an exercise that, you know, that you, you kind of uh, stick to and, you know, it just keeps you moving. Okay, if we don't find one, no problem. Move on to the next one. That's it.